Meme Time to Recovery, or MTTR, tracks how long, on average, your failure spans are. This measurement shows how quickly your team can respond and recover from failure, and in this video, I'll show you how Sleuth calculates it. The story for how Sleuth defines MTTR all starts in how Sleuth defines failure. The video for Change Failure Rate goes into more detail of all the different ways that Sleuth can help your team define failure, but the summary is, through all those different methods, it creates spans of time which your project is unhealthy. To calculate MTTR, Sleuth simply takes the period we're looking at. In this particular case, I'm looking at a two-week period. It finds all the unhealthy periods and averages them together, the mean time to recovery, and the average length of your failure time is your MTTR. Sleuth can track the MTTR not just for projects, but also for teams. Within Sleuth, a team is a group of people. And since Sleuth tracks deployments and looks at who are authors of the deployments, it can then figure out which deployments are relevant to what teams. I'll show you how that works. If we take a look at a deployment, there is an Authors tab. The Authors tab shows people who have either authored a commit or authored a pull request or performed the deployment. Sleuth looks at all the deploys which have authors that are inside the team. Then it enables to look at which projects those deployments are applicable to, looks at which failure periods of those projects fit within the time that deployment was activated. That's how it figures all the different failure periods for a project. Finally, it then breaks this down so you're able to see what the MTTR is for this team per project. And of course, you can wrap this number up into one high-level metric in the trend section where you can just see what is the MTTR across all my projects or of course you can then slice and dice even further by labels projects and of course teams if you'd like to know how sleuth calculates other dora metrics see the videos over here